guitar sales have risen 300% over the last seven years. The boom started with the rock and roll era and America's folk song revival. Guitars are now being manufactured in New Zealand. There are three factories making them. This one, the largest, is in Auckland. The solid bodies of these electric guitars are made of white mahogany. The block is routed out to make room for the electronic gadgetry which replaces the traditional hollow body in these instruments. Sanded to a pleasant and easy to handle shape and sprayed with a high gloss and slightly gaudy finish, the body is made ready to take the neck. The neck is cut from silver birch and shaped on a spindle moulder. Many of the techniques and methods used here are new and were developed in this factory. In their own quiet way, these guitars are adding to our export drive. Sales are rising in Australia and Hawaii. The rosewood fretboard is set in place and the neck is ready for the finishing touches. Most of the dozen men working here are guitarists. It's only a musician's hand can give the finished neck the feel and action necessary to a good instrument. The assembled guitar is strung and tuned, ready to be wired for sound or more accurately, sounds. With tremolo bridges, reverberation units, a number of tone and volume controls, and possibly a skillful musician, the electric guitar rivals the electronic organ for diversity of sounds. The pickups and amplifiers are also made in this factory, and apart from the German-made control knobs, all the components are locally produced. Put it in the fancy cabinet, plug it in, and another guitar is ready to get with it, twanging the twist to teenagers and sending the squares squirming. Thank you. 